BC. What's up, guys? Um, I'm back here to uh, show the uh, gift that I got from Mazzy from the contest. I was the uh, contest winner uh, last month. Uh, man, when I got it, man, I couldn't wait to crack that thing over. My wife was was like, wow, what, what kind of what box is this? Let me see what you want. So, yes, Mazzy, thanks, man. That's This is an awesome gift. The singles collection, Beatles. Man, this has 22 singles from 1962, of course, to like 1970, and then he got the ones from the 90s. Uh, this was pressed overseas in Germany. I checked it out. Man, the first one I played out of here was the uh, Something with the, you know, the George Harrison written song, Something. Man, you talking about it just jumped out of the damn, out of the speakers, man. I mean, this is an excellent set. I know every, everybody's seen it. Um, Mazzy, I'm really gracious for this gift, man. This is, I definitely come, this is a, this is a nice collection. Sounds great. Uh, I was looking at some of the stuff, too, when it came out. The guy that mastered it was uh, Sean McGee and how he was talking about, uh, I forgot the guy's name, but it was Harry, Harry Mason, or I think it was Harry Mason, I believe. I know he did some of the Dark Side of the Moon from the late 70s, but he worked uh, over at Abbey Road. Uh, they went in and, and they did a great job on this, man. Uh, you know, I do, a, I'm not going to show all, the, well, you know what, uh, I show all the singles. Um, I, I believe Mazzy went through this already, so uh, I, I was very happy with this. Uh, the booklet, killer, man, this stuff has all the great stuff talking about the Beatles singles that was released overseas. Um, and, I'm, you know, I'm not going to go over the... the you know the breakdown but they sound great I already got a chance to listen to everything here let me do this one here please please me oh man from me to you thank you girl I, some of this stuff man a lot of these early singles I don't have actually I'm gonna show you what I have from when I started collecting oh, this one's awesome too this is like a Greek press. Please, please me. She loves you. Twist and shout. This is like an EP. I want to hold your hand. This one's awesome, too. I love this one, too. This one's cool. Can't buy me love. Can't do that. Hard Day's Night film. Man, I love that it came with these polyline sleeves they sound great uh, I mean man I heard a lot of them are analog uh, I know the later ones from the 90s are the ones that are digital ticket to ride yes it is sweet 22 singles man this has air man I'm down help day triple work it out killer paperback writer rain yellow submarine Eleanor Rigby if I'm not mistaken strawberry fields penny lane and these these are all like the European on Odeon so this was pressed over in Germany all you need is love baby I'm a rich man yeah, this got to be, I'm a walrus and hello, goodbye. This is great. Great stuff. One of my favorites, too. One of my favorite stuff. Uh, this one is Inner Light, Lady Madonna. I like that little Japanese sleeve with a gatefold. Probably one of the only ones with the gatefold. Get back. Don't let me down. I love Don't Let Me Down. That's a great, great album. Uh, Hey Jude Revolution, the ballad of Yoko Ono and Brown Shoe. Man, that's a lot of them, man. Yeah, this was the first one I threw on, man. Come Together and Something. 
Man, you talking about that bass, man. Great stuff. Let it be. And you know my name. Look up the number. And this one was really cool. I think Jeff Lynn helped him with a couple of tracks. Free as a Bird. Real Love. Great stuff, man. All of that in this box. This is a great box. It's got some great stuff on it, man. Great, great, great. I just love the uh, Mazzy, man. I really appreciate it. And then Mazzy sent me, uh, he said, hey, Lavelle, congrats on the contest. Hope this adds to your collection. Cheers, Mazzy. Oh, yes, it does help. And came with a lot of the photography, which was cool, man. This is like a little psychedelic poster, Summer of Love. Love this, the uh, Mazzy scent, Summer of Love. This photography is cool. I checked out his website. It got some really cool photography, man, and a couple of the people that he was working with. And Mazzy is awesome, man. And some buttons, too, with the, the man with the hat. That look cool, Mazzy. Yes. Much appreciated, man. I really love this. This is an awesome box. Uh, pretty cool. I ain't even know this came out. You know, I haven't bought any Beatles stuff in a while. I've been uh oh I just haven't I haven't even um I'm mad I missed out on the mono box set. That was the one I wish I would have got. Um but here, here's my singles. When I started collecting, I started collecting the Beatles stuff in uh, 96. I went over to this guy's house on the north side. Uh, name was Michael Eflin. He's the only one I've seen a UK. He had a UK white album, mono. It was a low number, too. He had two of them. He said he's, he's selling the other one so he can move to California. This guy's collection was amazing. He had some Paul McCartney stuff that was, it was just sick. He had a turntable that was built back in the, I want to say the early 1900s. It was with the big needle. But yeah, he gave me, he gave me actually, he gave me, uh, he gave me two 45s, which I'm going to go through my 45s. He gave it to me as a gift. So I can start, am I starting to collecting? And I started collecting since then. And then I was off and on buying records here and there. I still was in the CDs, but I loved uh, buying records. So here's my uh, my Beatles 45. These are all American. This is uh, I Want to Hold Your Hand. Saw you standing there. That's uh, on the Capitol label. Hard Day's Night. I Should Have Known Better. Eight days a week. I didn't want to spoil the party. Really tough one to find with the picture sleeve. Uh, Ticket to Ride. Yes, it is. Capital. I'm not even going to show the back of them anymore. You know what the Capital Swirl is. Help. I'm down. Yesterday. Act naturally. This was an, this is the other one he gave me. Double B side. We can work it out. Day Tripper. This was oh, I love this. This is one of my favorite singles by them. Paperback Rider, Rain. Yellow Submarine. Sorry about the glare. Eleanor Rigby. These are all American. And this one, I love this one. I, you know, I still can't remember when did I, where did I get this one at, but this, this was an awesome find. I believe I got it at the Reckless, just thinking back at it, uh, the one in Chicago. But this is Penny Lane, Strawberry Fields. Love this, love this one. All You Need Is Love, Baby, I'm a Rich Man. Hello, Goodbye. This is from the Netherlands on the Parlophone label. I'll show you that one. That's a Parlophone original from 67. And I have an American one. I'm a walrus. Hello, goodbye. Uh, 
Hey Jew flip side, of course, is uh, Revolution. No picture sleeve. I would love to find that with a picture sleeve. And the last one, I remember this one. Somebody named Cindy wrote on here. Beatles, Ballad, John and Yoko. Those were my uh, 45 singles. And then you see some of my records, my records behind me. I don't have all the Beatles records, uh, but I definitely, I'm going to start by collecting some of the full, the uh, full length. So it's a couple of them, it's, you know, it's a couple of them I'm missing, but uh, yeah. But I got some really nice ones like that. Uh, Sergeant Peppers, that's a, an original stereo with the Partophone label. Uh, this one's a actual a recent acquisition. This is actually a 1985 direct metal master. Look that up. This one right here is one of the best sounding Beatles records. I won't put it over original mono UK, but it's probably number two. This is on white vinyl. This was pressed over in Germany in the, yeah, the mid 85 white vinyl. This sucker smokes. You put it on and you I compared it to my MoFi. The MoFi sound like crap. It just it's it's so d dead. The bass on here is it, it's hard to believe it's a direct metal master. The sound quality. I, I, this was a recent acquisition. Um, this was one I got last summer. This is an original. Help! I couldn't pass on this one. This was on the Powderphone label. This is an original mono with the flip back. Ah oh, man, I, I I saw how clean this was. I I couldn't believe it. I, I I the price, everything was was on the money. And then that's my uh, Capital. I have a Capital Revolver. Revolver is probably my favorite. It's my number one Beatles album. I like Revolver a lot. Um, that's in the Capital one. I'm still on the hunt for a uh, Parlophone UK. Not Apple. Apple's is okay, but Parlophone UK, definitely. I'm looking for that. And I had got this one some years back at one of the stores. I couldn't believe it. I only paid $20 for it, but this is, uh, I know everybody hates this record because this is the one with Ronnie Spector's, the, the mix was taken out. But this is Let It Be Naked, Japanese. These are hard to come by. And it has the the fly on the wall single. Uh, let's see if I can pull it out of here. Uh, where is that? And a booklet too. This one's cool. There goes the fly on the wall. And that. Yeah, but man, Mazzy. Guys, Mazzy looked out, man. That's it was an awesome, awesome contest. I uh, I appreciate everybody saying congratulations to me for winning this contest. Um, I participated in a lot of contests uh, over the years, and um, yeah, this was this was one of the man, man. When I got this in the mail, I couldn't wait to spend it. Oh, Mazzy, love you, man. Love you, brother. Appreciate it. Peace out, guys.